Hello guys and welcome to my channel. In my today's video I'm going to talk more about uh, my beauty skincare routine, about uh, makeup removing process. Uh, so I think this is going to be interesting and uh, in particular I would like to concentrate on this uh, product by Filorga. It's their foam cleanser. So basically it cleanses and removes makeup and it hydrates your skin. I was on a lookout for a really good but mild uh, cleanser for my face for a long time and I'm so happy that I managed to find this one by Filorga. I also had the one beauty favorite by this brand, it was their oxygenating mask, which was super bubbly and uh, really, really weird. I think I made a video on it and I really loved it, but I ran out of it. And then I wanted to try out this one. Uh, I bought it uh, through, I think it was online pharmacy, Italian website, and uh, I purchased it. It was on a special offer because their products are a little bit on the pricier side, but this foam cleanser wasn't expensive, uh, so I think it retailed for less than 20 euros, which I think is a really good price for such product. Also, I need to mention it's super concentrated, so you don't need to squeeze too much of the product, you know. Uh, only one pump uh, will do uh, for your entire face and neck as well. Uh, so I usually use this product um, every night when I'm removing makeup. If I'm not removing makeup, if I don't have makeup on that day, then I will just wash my face with natural soap made of goat's milk and honey. Uh, and that will do and I will then apply some natural oils on my face and some very very moisturizing creams as you guys already probably know because I spoke about it but if I'm removing my makeup I have uh, some steps that I follow so usually first I will uh, remove my makeup with uh, natural almond oil I will just apply it on the palms of my hands, rub it in my fingers and then I will go all over my face, massaging my face and you know, eyelids very carefully until my makeup is like dissolved and then I will just remove everything off with the cotton pads and micellar water. I really do love Bioderma micellar water but currently I'm using one which is um, from a local Italian supermarket and I find it it's really good it does its job it's from Conad supermarkets but it's irrelevant but this is like the second step this is where Filorga steps in uh, it's like a third step of makeup removal where I will use water and foam cleanser so basically I will just squeeze out one pump you will have this really rich luxurious foam that comes out from basically this liquid transforms into foam and uh, I put it uh, on this uh, sponge it's natural sponge from the Adriatic Sea so this is the sponge I got at my local drogery mart and you can find it at Bipa drugstores but it's 100% natural sponge from the Adriatic Sea and I have a bigger one for my body as well but this is the one that I use for my face and then I will basically massage my face and just make sure that all the traces of oil and dirt makeup is dissolved and removed and then I will wash my face with warm water so yeah that will complete my makeup removal afterwards my face is super super clean and i always make sure to apply a toner i usually apply rose water or chamomile water lavender water or immortal water i really do love those natural toners um, and then i will apply my natural oils and rich creams moisturizers for my face because we're usually talking about nighttime skincare routine where i do really need some extra love on my face you know when i wake up in the morning i want to see the results i want that you know baby like uh, smooth skin so yeah and this is really what works well for me i think the essential thing is uh, to remove your makeup and clean your face every night before going to sleep and to really moisturize it well to take care of your skin uh, this product here is amazing because it's very mild very gentle yet it's very effective it really removes your makeup very very well without leaving your face stripped off 
all the natural oil it's sort of like squeaky clean it really still leaves your face uh, hydrated uh, because it contains hyaluronic acid i think it's important to notice it contains hyaluronic acid so obviously it's not harsh it's not drying and i really feel uh, when I'm done with removing my makeup before I apply toner, I don't feel that my skin is, you know, tight, uh, itchy, dry, but I really feel that it's like replenished even. And uh, thanks to this product here, I noticed, I really noticed a big difference when I introduced this product in my um, skincare routine. So I think I will keep repurchasing it um, or this, or possibly I could try some other products uh, such as Aphrodita which I really love it's Slovenian uh, skincare and I think they do have a cleansing foam so I might try that one but as I've told you this one is one of my definite favorites and something that I would like to keep repurchasing in the future I do have it for months and I still have quite a bit of it so it's concentrated it's long lasting you don't need to exaggerate one pump is enough as I've mentioned and uh, it's really good for sensitive skin as well because it's hydrating, it's very mild, it won't irritate you, it won't dry out your skin. It's nothing really harsh. But for me it works in synteny with other products that I'm using. Um, as I've mentioned, almond natural oil and micellar water. And in combination with those two products, this one is just amazing, works absolutely perfectly in removing makeup. So you have my biggest recommendation. Yeah, I think that's everything I wanted to mention. Just a quick review. Let me know if you tried any other Filorga products. If you have, what do you recommend? What are your favorites? Is there a must-have product by Filorga that you would like to share with the rest of us? I would really enjoy hearing more about your opinions and your recommendations. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you found it helpful. If you have any requests for my future videos, don't hesitate to leave me a comment because I always note everything down in my notebook and then I film videos that you guys want to watch. Uh, make sure to press thumbs up, share this video on your social medias with your friends and family because that way you're helping this channel grow a bit and it really means a lot to me. Now I'm sending you all a big kiss from Croatia and I will talk to you soon in my next video. Mm. Ciao!